lights on? Should be. High beams? Low beam now? How does it feel now? Gas pedal feels tight. It's like my That's old all? one did. Oh, okay. Not about the... Um... Oh, you mean the item? Mm-hmm. The item feels good. I have to get used to this. Uh... Right? No. <laughs> yeah, you gotta replace that. <laughs> Still bangs in the gear though. It starts on a cold start. Yeah. In the, in the morning. Well, what you do is on a cold day, you just take a pump that gas pedal once or twice, take the foot off and hit the starter, and it should start right up. Then do it by a choke, it'll be something. I pumped it uh, when it was missing uh, like four or five times and then started. Yeah. See what that pays out. Jump 
jumping. Like it went yeah. out of the cradle. Yeah, now it sits in there and it doesn't move. Yep. Now you got all, it's nice. Got all the part valves working now. And it's shifting. Yeah, well, see, see what it was doing before, Bill. It was using vacuum. Yeah. You had a burnt valve and the motor has trying the motor's trying to adjust for the burnt valve. And the transmission is trying to get vacuum, which you can't get. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, 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 you had two things fighting. Yeah. Now Here's all your numbers here. Well, if you take that all off here and get on the computer, I'll tell you exactly. I already did that. Mm -hmm. Actually, I called Ford, and mm -hmm. Ford sent me the information off there, mm -hmm. and they had one thing wrong. They said it was a 221 VA, oh, which, it's not. which is wrong. Right. And the the VIN number U, right, right indicates a, a 176 cylinder. Right. And uh, I think maybe this part could have been a V8. No, no, no. no it's you're... got a five lug. I'm just looking. It's got five lug wheels on it, Skip. They all did. I six thought, or eight I had five the six lugs. Only had four lugs. Mm -hmm. well, maybe in the Fairlane they made it all five good. because it's a little bit heavier car. I know the Mustangs were four and five. Falcons, lower, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. But the uh, yeah, this, yeah, this might have a pumpkin type rear. Let me pull out so you can have a look. No, I can. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to look under there. Oh. Yeah, this is a pumpkin type. This is where the pumpkin dumps out the front. Otherwise, if you were changing rears, you got the same type of rear I got mine. Yeah, same thing as yours. Does it have a, a drain yeah. plug? To change the uh, some of these did some of them didn't. Uh, it has a drain plug and it's going to be on the very bottom of the rear. It's at the top. Well, that's to check it. You take that out to put your finger in there and check the fluid. But if you wanted to drain it, some of these had a plug on the bottom. It just it was like a big plug. You just took it out and the fluid ran out of it. Put that back up. The plug up top is where you put the fluid in. It's like a fuel pan. Yeah, basically. All right. But it's not a plug that would stick down in. It's a plug that's flat with the housing. In other words, you take like a ratchet, yeah, yeah, like a yeah, an extension, extension and stick it in here, and go up inside it. Oh, I see. Take it out okay. That. Usually, that's the way they are. Oh, yeah. okay. Well, that's the plug. So that's it like might up be so. The if there is yeah. one there, it yeah. might be so dirty you can't see it until you clean yeah, it. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this could be a 308 ratio. Could, could, yeah. could be a 300 ratio. Yeah. See, they made the plugs like that there, I guess, so nothing got caught on when they were going down the road, you know? So they're not were sticking out. Well, looks like it's going to rain, guys. Oh, no, it's not. getting damp. I hope not. Yeah, I feel it. Oh, well, we got it running. That's it's running nice. Yep. That's where you want it. She's hitting all six of them now. Thanks guys.